The TM Flex system from Tiny Machines 3D combines the durability and bed adhesion of PEI with a spring steel sheet that can be flexed to release your prints from the build surface. A magnetic mat is provided to adhere to the bed surface or lower bed carriage on some printers to hold the steel sheet in place while printing. The TM Flex magnetic print surface with PEI is available in several sizes to fit most popular 3D printer brands and models. This video demonstrates how to install the TM Flex 310 on a Sidewinder X1 from Evnovo, formerly known as Artillery. You'll need a few things before you get started with the installation. Paper towels, isopropyl alcohol, at least 70% concentrated, preferably in a spray bottle, a utility knife or single edge blade, a squeegee with a soft covered edge, or a rigid straight edge covered with a cloth. With your cleaning supplies and application tools ready, use the control panel on the printer to raise the gantry to at least 20 centimeters and move the bed to the front of the printer. This gives you better access to prepare the surface and install the magnetic pad. First, use a towel with isopropyl alcohol and thoroughly clean the bed or mounting surface of all adhesive residue, leftover print material, and dust and debris. The surface must be clean and free of anything that may create bumps or ripples in the mat. The steel sheet must be perfectly flat for optimal first layer adhesion and successful prints. Before installation, inspect the mat to ensure it's free of any creases or cuts. Then check the fit and orientation on the bed to ensure you apply it correctly. Peel back one edge of the bagging to expose about two inches of the adhesive surface. Then align the mat to one corner and two edges of the bed. Once the edge is in place, begin to press the mat down with your fingers. Then use the squeegee or cloth covered edge to work across the bed as you pull the backing out from under the mat. You may also use a towel to adhere the mat while removing the backing. Firmly press the mat in place with a clean towel or the waxy side of the mat's backing material. Use the one-sided razor blade or sharp utility knife to trim excess material. Exposed adhesive can catch on the frame or wiring. Before placing the steel bed surface, use the isopropyl alcohol and a towel to clean the magnetic surface of any debris and oils. Align the steel bed surface to the mat so it won't hit or rub on the printer's frame. Before you heat the bed and begin printing, don't forget to remove the protective coating and prepare the PEI surface by cleaning it with isopropyl alcohol. Some printers may require the Z end stop to be repositioned because the build surface height has changed after installing the magnetic mat and steel bed surface. With automatic bed leveling systems, such as the BL Touch, the Z offset will be adjusted automatically. If your printer has an adjustable bed, warm the bed to about 60 degrees Celsius and adjust the knobs to level the bed, and you're ready to print. Adding a skirt to your print allows you to check that the bead of filament is slightly squashed, and you can adjust the Z offset or baby steps on the fly as needed, before the actual print begins. Once a print is complete, let everything cool down then use the tabs to easily lift the surface from the magnetic mat. Flex the surface gently and the print will release. Never again will you have to tug, pull, pry, or use sharp tools to remove your prints. You can order the TM Flex system for your 3D printer the Sidewinder X1, and many other tested, reliable 3D printers online at tinymachines3d.com. Inspected and tested 3D printers. Upgrade installations by experienced technicians. Excellent service and support. Tiny Machines 3D.